We keep it rough, we keep it raw, we keep it real, and your boy keep it 1,000. Hey, yeah, Reaper, we all about doing them good things, bringing good messages to the burbs in the hood, man, and everywhere else in between, y'all, so keep game, Reaper gonna call you on your message, this with no shame, so listen while your boy discuss interesting topics from the cold climates all the way down to the tropics, I'm not it, let's get your popcorn, right and set, go, sit back and relax while you're checking out the Reaper show, so here's, it might come off a little rough, ready and grimy, but maybe you should toughen up. As we discuss these topics that are real, man, don't take it personal and be caught up in your feelings. Jazz Bo, aka the Reaper on the airwaves, spitting real talk, cause yo, that's what the people play. Hit the like button, then subscribe, save up in your faves, go and play it back like, wait, what? What did he just say? to the topic. Corey Holcomb, cheerleading for R. Kelly to be released, and Corey says he's innocent on all charges. But what I want to say to you, nigga, is, because the Reaper always keep it 1,000, right? You were sitting up there saying that R. Kelly should go to jail. He been messing with little girls and he gonna go to jail. And, you know, deservingly so. I mean... You was the biggest, you know, uh, person saying that, you know, uh, for R. Kelly saying that he should be convicted. The Reaper keep it 1,000. Now, you his biggest cheerleader. See, this is what we don't like about you, nigga, you know, and you're not keeping it 1,000 is because you, you try to be the black activist, right? 
and you shouldn't because you know what? Every motherfucking thing that you say, mostly you backtrack on, nigga. The Reaper keep it 1,000, and this is why the Reaper be chewing on your ass, you know? Uh, I'm not gonna even lie, you know, because you are not a real nigga when it comes to an activist. So, Corey, what I'm telling you is you need to stick to what you do best, you know, telling the truth about women and telling jokes. Reaper keep it 1,000. But all of this R. Kelly activist shit, and he's innocent, and just because you spoke to him and shit, nigga, you know, and now you done became a fan again, what'd you ask him to help you with some of your music like you did, you know, that singing clown precise? <laughs> <laughs> nigga, stop being phony. You know, see, this is why the Reaper be on Corey's ass, you know, because he's not above criticism. Do you say some real shit? Yeah, you say some real shit, nigga. And you know what? I applaud you for that. But the Reaper gonna be on your ass like a dog on a motherfucking bone when you start backtracking and being a cheerleader for R. Kelly. All you needed was your pom-poms, nigga. You was cheering for him so hard uh, and everything just because you spoke to him. But it's amazing because, you know, I mean, you was down with them broads, you know, before the Reaper keep it 1,000. Now, I'm not going to say you was always down with these broads, but you were saying that nigga need to go to jail. They're going to get R. Kelly. You know, he going to jail for the rest of his life. I mean, you were saying that on every show before he got convicted. The Reaper keep it 1,000. I mean, that's why niggas in the chat room were saying, what the fuck is this? You know, but this is the kind of shit that you do. And then people be wondering why the Reaper be on your ass. Because you know what? I want your ass to be one way. Like like they said, Luther and Oprah need to stay one way when they was losing weight and shit. And they would get back fat again. Well, nigga, you need to stay one way. You know, I mean, either, you know, you don't like R. Kelly and you feel he should go to jail. Or you gonna cheerlead him for him, you know, like a whole ass nigga. Reaper, we keep it rough, we keep it raw, we keep it real. Make sure you subscribe to the Reaper. Reaper out. Peace.